little story that some of you may have already heard because it did become famous, but I'm sure there's somebody in here that hasn't heard it, and even if you have, I'm sure it'll increase your faith no matter what. There was a man who, who had a really good job. He was, I guess what you would say, living the American dream. He had most of his mortgage paid off. He was building up a good savings. Things were really going good. He had a good job, good health insurance. And then one day, he came down with spinal meningitis. And they couldn't get it corrected. They couldn't get anything to work. And he lost his job. He lost his insurance. He lost his savings as he was trying to pay for everything. He had to end up taking his mortgage. Everything was down to zero. Everything was going bad for him. And on top of it, he began to have rheumatoid arthritis kick in and the pain became so intense that he slipped into a coma. And he was laying there in the hospital in this coma and they, they couldn't do anything for him so they, they called the priest in to give him last rites. And the priest came in and he, he did the last rites and he, he, get, and he walked out the room. And as soon as that priest walked out of the room in his black dress clothes, another priest walked into the room. But he didn't come in through the door, he came in through the wall. And he wasn't dressed in black, he was dressed in all white. And he came over to the man and he leaned down to him and he said, you don't have a problem. All you need is faith in God. And that man was laying there and thinking, I'm in a coma, nobody, I can't respond to anything going on. I've lost everything, I'm in intense pain. If I don't have a problem, then I don't know what a problem is. And then he said, I'm Jesus Christ and I've come here to heal you. And when I heal you, I want you to immediately get up, go into the bathroom, clean yourself up, shave your beard, and then go and buy a Bible and read the book of John. And then he stood up and he walked right back out of the wall. A few minutes later, the nurse came in to pull the sheet over his head because she was sure he was dead. And she walked in and there was nobody in the bed. And she thought, what in the world's this? And she looked over and the light was on in the bathroom. And she opened up the door and there was that man in the bathroom and she screamed. She said, what are you doing? You're supposed to be dead. He goes, I know. He goes, the priest came in and gave you last rites.